Hi there, my name is Mary Metzger. I'm a VCU Communication Arts alum, and today I am so excited to show you all how to make an amazing portfolio website using Adobe Portfolio. But first, a little about me. I graduated from VCU Arts in 2019 with a BFA in Communication Arts. I love illustration, especially working on any project where I can draw or paint the natural world around me. One of my favorite projects that I created at VCU was But You Don't Look Sick, a short book that I self-published after interviewing a number of peers living with invisible chronic illnesses. During my senior year at VCU, I submitted But You Don't Look Sick to the Adobe Design Achievement Awards, and in May, just a month after graduating and walking across the stage, I found that I had won their Top Talent Award. Soon after, Adobe whisked me away to LA to attend their Adobe Max conference, where I got to check out early Adobe technology while also learning from industry giants like M. Night Shyamalan, Takashi Murakami, David LaChapelle, and more. John Mulaney and Billie Eilish were also there, which I was honestly probably even more excited about. But honestly, it wasn't just the project that gave me that opportunity, even though it was pretty cool. It was also the presentation. Whether you're a writer, a painter, a chef, an educator, or an illustrator like me, presenting yourself well with a website is so important. Personally, I've had to share my website hundreds of times to clients in job applications and project proposals, and also when I submitted my project to Adobe too. Luckily, with an Adobe Creative Cloud subscription, you can publish a website for free using Adobe Portfolio. All VCU students can purchase a Creative Cloud subscription for a heavily reduced rate, $60 for one year, $30 for six months, or $15 for three months. To purchase your subscription, visit adobe.vcu.edu and follow the provided instructions. So now you guys are almost ready to start creating your own Adobe Portfolio website. Thanks for tuning in.